Well, now it's a party. I've got Biscuit. You can see his tail. Huh. Who's a handsome boy? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're a handsome boy. I pick him up, but he doesn't like that. And then I have Baby Girl on top of the bear by the window. If you look behind the bear's head, you'll see her head. She's moving around a little. And then Torby is on the couch, but you can't see her. And then Mr. Rumbles here. That's what Ron used to call him sometimes. Mr. Rumbles. He is purring. So, uh, my aunt came by, and we went to the bank. Um, a friend of mine in the vending industry gave me a love offering in $1 bills. So I wanted to convert it to something a little more spendable. And um, so I am... Um, yeah, I can do it that way. Um, so I had to stand in a very long line, but I turned the ones into 20s. Yay. Then we went out to lunch at my favorite taqueria. And I got a small quesadilla and two tacos. They were really good. And um, then we went to the post office and got my mail. There wasn't a whole lot. Just a couple of charity newsletters, but that's good. I am giving a little to charity, so I think it's important you know, to spread the gospel. Especially now, I mean. So anyways, and then we went to Academy Sports. And I got an ice chest and I wrote my name on it so I can take it to work. This will be so nice in the summer. Oh, it's got cat hair on it. Um, it'll be so nice in the summer. I put a big ice block in there, freeze something, and stick it in there and have a nice cold drink, you know, because uh, it's important to stay hydrated and coming home in the afternoon in the summer is going to suck on the bus. It's just going to suck. And then I got some shoes. I won't show you all of them. But shoes are important. So I got these. I've had these before. And I really like them. And they lasted a long time. So and I put the shoe bag on. Biscuit! And Biscuit is still rubbing against me. There. And then, this is the fanciest one I got. Skechers. Flip resistance. Sketchers work wide fit memory foam. It won't let me get electrocuted and it's slip resistant, which seems really smart to have for work. And they're pretty light. And wide too. I need a wide shoe. So set in that regard because it's really important to have good shoes because um, let's be blunt I'm middle aged I'm fat I'm standing on my feet hours every day at work so it needs to be something supportive for the foot oh, won't you come and say hello you're so handsome Everybody would love you. Everybody would love you. So, then we came home, and she went home, and I'm here. And, uh, just kind of sad today. Baby girl there reminds me of the woman in Revelation riding the beast with 
ten horns. You know, except with the cat riding a bear. Only in my house. You can just see his ear. Yeah, there he is. He's there. He's been shedding a pretty good amount. It wasn't really warm today, though. What was that? It wasn't really warm today, though. So I don't know why I'm shedding so much, but it must be a circadian rhythm or something. But, uh, you know. So that was my day, pretty much. So I got decent shoes, at least. That'll be very nice when I go back to work. Tomorrow I have off. I'm going to be doing housework. So, you know, we'll see how that goes. So, you know, it's important to keep up with all that. And uh, it shouldn't take me too long. And I don't think it's going to rain for a while. So I don't have to worry about the cats tracking mud in the house, either. But... Today it's just one of those days at home where I'm just depressed and I miss Ron and it sucks to be widowed and that's pretty much it, you know. I miss him. But there's no easy way to process all that and if I was doing the whole Mary Widow thing and going out and partying and having a good time, like um, that one woman with a dead baby, you know, it sure wouldn't look good, even if I wanted to party, which I don't. I am glad I got rid of anything in the house that could even be remotely addictive, including Ron's pain pills. I know I was supposed to dispose of them properly, but I just threw them out and uh, don't regret doing that at all. So. I figure if I have a condition where I need pain pills, I could just go and get them for myself. I don't have to get in his. Not to mention, taking them ahead of time would probably disqualify me from actually getting them. Anyway, that's it for now.